back to my channel if it's your first time here welcome i'm mallory and today's video is our ipsy glam bag plus unboxing if you're not familiar with ipsy they do three different types of subscriptions one of them you get like five trial size products like the mini versions and then the middle version is the one that i have the glam bag plus where you get five full size products and the third one you get like eight I want to say but it's like $50 a month and I mean that's a little crazy for me this box is about $25 a month you get five full-size products and I love it like I feel like I've only gotten like a couple bad boxes but this one is really really good this is how the box comes discover yourself so it always comes with a little card and it will this the thing for this month is full bloom so it will tell you how much everything is in the box i think that this box is supposed to retail like the value of it it's supposed to be like 125 dollars for me the price of it doesn't really matter i just want good stuff in my box so i'm gonna set that aside for just a second so with the ipsy glam bag just the bag you get the, this little bag and you get your like trial size products in there on my face i'm like glittery y'all ignore my bad skin i'm having a hard time okay with this quarantine <laughs> um anyway so this bag is super cute it goes with the theme i've never seen like a little thing like this before that's super cute look at that mm -hmm. upon opening the box this is what we have so i'm going to go down the the list of things in order now with this eyeshadow look that i'm wearing today i did use a lot of stuff that was in the box but i'll go over that later first thing that we have in the box is this dutch dirt mask by bloom effects this retails for 49 dollars. so this is a little steep for a face mask but like i said a minute ago like my face like i'm really having a hard time with this quarantine and i've been able to just go to ulta and get like my face wash and stuff so like i'm waiting on an ulta order right now actually so in the meantime i was like well what can i do like i need a mask i need face wash i need all this stuff and this came in and i was like yes i need this so it says short on time this massage a small amount of this mask onto damp skin for 30 seconds for quick yet totally effective exfoliation that's for if you just want to wash your face with it but if you have the time like i did today i would definitely suggest using this as a mask you leave it on for 20 minutes and it literally like i got some of it on here you can kind of see it's it looks like dirt like for real <laughs> I don't remember smelling it before I just sniffed it again, but um, I, it doesn't have like a like an overbearing smell, like something that you remember, not really. But what I really like about it is that as soon as it went on, like I could kind of feel it tingling, which I like because to me that says that it's working. And it sucked in my face, it made it kind of tight, so I was like, oh yes, yeah, this is good. It reminds me of like the Alia Skin Pink, um, it's like an Alaskan clay mask. That's what it reminds me of, except it feels like dirt, so it's kind of like grimy and dirty. Um, dirty feeling on your skin until you wipe it off and then I just kind of felt like oh this is different but like good different so that's what this is it'll help refresh and rebalance your skin make large pores I think of the past so needed that moving on I also got the Ciate London triple shot double XL mascara now this mascara it says you'll need more than just water to take this stuff off at the end of the day I'm assuming that thing is waterproof but it's a jet black mascara and this stuff so i did use it today i'm not sure how hard it'll be taken off because i haven't taken it off yet but it did not clump it kind of reminds me of the Too faced better than sex mascara this this is definitely a winner in my book i wish they sold Cigate at like a store that i could just like ulta for instance like i could just go in and get it because i would definitely buy a lot more of their products that way but it's 22 dollars retail value so kind of like the better than sex as far as prices go, but it definitely works just as good. Also loved that one. I told y'all this box, I mean, Ipsy they just really gave me all the goods this time. Next on our list is the Shayna B Miami Mini Miami Eyeshadow Palette. I did use this and only this for my eyeshadow today. So this value is for $20. And honestly, I feel like this is worth the money. Let me show you the colors. They're very like, plain colors but like you have all your mattes down here i use these two and i use heat and um this port princess and overall i don't have any like 
any complaints about it. It did have some fallout, but I mean, that's to be expected with the shimmer, but it did blend really well. The colors are pigmented. I overall thought this was a pretty good palette. And for $20, I mean, this is like a steal. Like it's a staple. You can use it. Anybody can use it. My third favorite thing in the box, <laughs> like everything in the box <laughs> the time, I was just like, yes, yeah, like keep, keep giving it to me, it's see. So this is the um, Sella Cream Rose, the very best cream rose. This is a moisturizer. So this is $39. It says slather this body cream on damp skin as soon as you hop out the shower, it'll lock in extra water for long, long lasting hydration. So this, I did take a shower and I used this today, like how it instructed me. This smells so good. Like it just like soaks into your skin and like my skin feels really nice and I smell really good and like, $39, so that's kind of steep. I don't think I would have paid that for this, but um, if I had to compare it to a smell, it'd probably be that Soap and Glory, The Righteous Butter. It kind of smells like that, except a little bit stronger, I think. It smells so, so, so good. Last but not least, the last thing in the box is the Tarte Tardius Pro Liquid. Well, wait, it's the Double Take Eyeliner in Black. Now, it does have two sides. I like this black because it's like super black. Like, look at how, oh, look at my skin. Oh, it's so bad. Oh my God. I'm just gonna cover it. Ignore it. You see how dark it is? See? Oh, it's so nice. Okay, so one side is the pencil and you like twist it up. And then the other side is this felt tip. And oh my gosh, I love it. I don't normally like a lot of tart things, but lately I've been like loving them. I don't know, maybe. Maybe I just had like a, a bad batch of Tarte cosmetics before or what, but like, I'm like loving them right now. Like, okay, so neither here nor there. So it says, Cat Eye Noob, create your best line using the liquid liner first. And if it's bumpy, no big deal. Glide the pencil right on top then smudge it out with a brush tool to create a smoky effect. So this is $20, $24, which, um, I'm glad I got it in the box because I would have never bought it. Like $24 for eyeliner, I just think that's kind of crazy. Especially since like one of my favorite eyeliners is by e.l.f. and it's like $8, like a liquid liner. So overall, like it says that, oh, I didn't even see this at the top. It says roses are red, violets are blue. These five gift bag plus products valued at $125, $120 plus were picked just for you. So they really did a good job. Like, round of applause to Ipsy. I don't remember doing that in elementary school. Round of applause. I was like really happy with this box. Like, I don't have anything in the box that I'm just like, I'm not gonna use except for maybe this bag. I don't really understand why they still give us the bag. I'm kind of thinking of like maybe putting like some like tampons and like maybe like a bar, like a small bar of soap or like a small like deodorant or something like and give this to like homeless people. I mean, right now I can't really do that with the quarantine, but I do have a lot of these bags and I was trying to find a purpose for them because I don't really have one right now. If you have any ideas about what to do with these bags, please leave that in the comment below because like I do want to do that, but right now I, I since we don't really know when the quarantine is ending, I don't know like when I'm actually gonna be able to do that. But if you have any ideas, please let me know in the comment box below. If you do not have Ipsy already and you're thinking about getting it, you can use um, my referral code in the description box below to look through it, see if that's something that you want. I do not get any money for it. I'm not sponsored, but I do get like points, but everybody gets points. So if you were to sign up, put your referral code somewhere and then your friend signs up, you would get points also. So it's just their referral system. Last but not least, if you do like my eyeshadow look, there is gonna be a tutorial up for it on Friday using everything that was in the box. Click and watch another one. Also subscribe, like this video, leave your comments below. Thank you guys so much for watching and you'll see my face in the next video.